Hey, what's up? I'm Forrest. All right, in today's video, we're going to create an entire lo-fi hip hop beat from scratch using just my phone and Ableton. If you don't have Ableton, you can grab a 90 day free trial from their website. And uh, when that runs out, you know, use your imagination. Anyways, I started by just grabbing some super basic drum samples. Here's a clip of me doing that. Hey. Yeah. Doesn't need to be anything fancy. Then I just cut out the ones I wanted to use and put them into a drum rack. Then I put some effects on the drums to make them sound, you know, more drummy. Then I arranged them into a basic halftime lo-fi groove. So if you don't know what that is, it's just a kick drum on the first downbeat, snares on every third beat, and hi-hats on every quarter note. I nudged every other hi-hat over to get that kind of swung syncopated lo-fi groove thing. Then I add some more drum notes for that extra sauce. Then I moved on to adding some bass and synths and such. For that, I went ahead and took some very high quality phone recordings of me singing. Oh yeah, baby. Real professional. Then I cut that up, repitched it, added some EQ, added some reverb, and a couple layers to get this bad boy. I was kind of pitchy, but honestly, I leaned into that sound and made it work for me. Every sound has value. You just gotta give it the love it deserves. All right, next I made a couple of synths using Ableton Simpler. So I grabbed some of those lovely vocal sounds and messed around with the controls until I got stuff I liked. It's actually easier than you think to make pads out of a vocal sound, and I'll probably do a whole video on this process, but for now, here's the settings that I messed with. I also made a little horn synth and an arpeggiated synth to add movement and emphasis to the beat. I like layering stuff like this in order to flesh out the soundscape. Alright, so I finished the bulk of the instruments and the basic composition of the loops. The next step is to figure out how I want to arrange the pieces as a whole and what kind of effects I want to put on it to really make it pop. So I think the most important mixing tool to make a lo-fi hip hop beat sound good is to use sidechain compression. I'm gonna do an entire video dedicated to sidechain compression, but here's the basic idea. So you tell a compressor to listen to your kick drum and your snare drum like this. Then the compressor, compressor, compressor? I can't even say that. Then the compressor pushes down the signal of your other instruments when it hears your drums. So an easy way to do this is to group all the instruments together and put the sidechain compressor on the group. I've got one for the kick and another one for the snare. After that, I added some effects automation to give each section of the song a different feel, and it was basically done. I added a tiny bit of compression and EQ on the master track as well to meld everything together and bring out the high end. Yeah, that's a lot of gain on the highs here, but take a listen to the difference. Probably better ways to do this, but I wanted to get it done fast and this does the job. And without further ado, here's the finished track. Let me know what you think in the comments and what I should show you next time. Peace.